vacuum plate blanket I poured yesterday uh, 815 uh, made a port out of cast iron uh, as you can tell it uh, was able to machine it off uh, that's probably as far as I'll go with it unless somebody needs it or I need to make something out of it to fit this little nine inch lathe this is a piece over here on the mill that's uh, just a square block that I ram up at times for a test pour or if I know if I'm going to do a pour for a part try to make a little extra makes a nice blocks for stock it's about five inches long four and a half inches wide more like four by five four by four and a half about an inch and a half thick uh, I'm going to take a cut off the top of it here to show, show people how this iron's cutting. It's going to get a little noisy. Get a, I'm using a... Let me stop a minute. This is a... Three flute face mill using triangular carbide inserts. Uh, get a little better light on it here. Maybe uh, inch and a half. It's uh, from uh, picked it up not too long after I got the mill. I've uh, got an inch and a quarter and a two flute like to have one in a four. Let's we'll have to see about getting one. Okay, here we go. RPMs, hand feed, uh, nothing hot coming off, it's not showing any heat or uh, cuts like cast iron supposed to cut. Back up here and get a little deeper. Pick up about another, take about another 25 thousandths. Material for home casted iron, cast iron. So I'm happy with it. Looks so like it's going to come out, get a full phase. Really nice cut 